Welcome to raikurkul.com. In this video, we'll discuss about how to create field and whenever it is not required, we can delete it permanently. So here we'll discuss about fields, administrations and how to create a new field or customize field whenever it is required. Because when we are working on the enterprises, it's not always we can use the same existing fields which is available in service now. So here I will show you how we can create it practically and whenever it is not required, we can delete it from our table as well. Fields are the individual piece of data in a record are called fields. Users enter data in fields on the form or by using the list editor. Administrators can create new or modify existing fields. User can enter data in fields by using list editor or by using a form in the form view. Fields appear as field in the form and the list view, they appear as column of data in the table. Administrators can create new field or change the type of existing fields whenever it is required. Now, let me show you how we can create the fields. So for creating a field, we have to go to the any form navigator. So let me jump to the problem form and open some problems here. So select any of the problem from here and when we want to configure it, definitely we have to go to the form design. Inside the form design, you will find it out different fields are available. So majorly we are looking from the layout point of view. So simply we have to go to the form layout where all of the listed fields which is available in service now login credentials so if i want to create a new field simply i will go here and add the field name let's say demo is my field name and th there are several type of field type is available so if you don't know about field type please watch my previous sessions which i have already created and i will also include the url in my description tab so these are the field types which is available in service now select any of the type from here let me add html here and you'll find it our field type is added but if i want to create type of string so you'll find it out third option as well like field length so how many length you are expecting to add it in this field you can select it simply small medium large and extra large let me add it large largest thousand only so you can click on add and this field will be available here so once we'll go here search for this specific field so let me enter demo it's not available here it should be available at the end now you can see this field is added here now if i will click on save and this field will receive permanently so let me click on save close this and navigate back to the field you can see here demo is added here and i've added for the launch because of that it's showing large text box so if i want to change any parameter or label of this field simply I will click configure label and it will need to uh, navigate to the label page where I can change all of the required fields and click on update that field will be updated permanently but if I want to delete it permanently then I will simply click on delete sections and this field will be deleted permanently so right now I'm not doing anything here I will just go to this parameter and simply uh, right click on this and you'll find out different other options like configure dictionary, configure styles. We can change its styles as well in the future as well. So if we have created any fields and we are using right now, but if we want to modify that field, we can modify it. If I want to show you demo, you demo also available in dictionary field. You'll find it out dictionary info. This is the table type and field udemo type is string maximumly thousand and attributes name is here now if i want to make the changes on the or delete the complete field 
So I will simply click on configure dictionary and here I will find it out complete detail. Let me say I want to make this field as mandatory. So I will check it here and click on update. This field will, will be mandatory for problem statement. So whenever user is not entering any detail, it will throw an error message. I can change the type as well from here. Then the column name, column label, then maximum length. I can make it possible to change it. But if I don't want this field to be available in my form, simply I will click on delete and it will ask for my permission if you want to permanently delete from your developer instance. So if I will click on OK, this field will permanently delete it and that field will no more available here. Same thing if I want to do it for the this as well. Simply I will go to configurations and click on delete and that field will be again deleted. So this is how we are creating a new field, changing their field parameters, label or different other parameters. We can change it whenever it is required. So that's all about creation of new field or updating or deleting or changing modification details. We can we have already seen in this video. So if you really enjoyed this video and you think this is very much informative, kindly share within your circle. Thank you for watching.